Oh, welcome back once more, everyone. Today we have. Jeez, I haven't fit it. The uh, One Piece Card Game Devil Fruit Collection Volume 1 Gum Gum Fruit, or Gum Gum No Me. Nice, uh, nice model of Luffy's Devil Fruit there. You can sort of, well, oh, when I take it out, you'll see how big it is. Um, uh, we have two of those and also some one-off cards, so we'll do those at the end. Uh, so, can I even fit this in the box? I'm not really set up for a giant box, so. Take the floor. So. Side we have Luffy. Uh, back we have a list of list of contents. So booster packs. Uh, there are two special Don cards. So hopefully we can get both of those. If not, we'll have to try and track the rest of them down. And some card sleeves. Uh, thankfully, I remembered to actually cut the tape this time. So easier to get into. So we'll pull it out and uh, we'll be back in a second have a look and hopefully I will be able to fit it on as I deafen everyone with my amazing opening skills. Alrighty, so uh, I might end up just cutting in a photo of the devil fruit itself at the end as a single piece. but. You can sort of see. Gets the palm of your hand. Very impressively uh, detailed. Yeah. I mean, even the uh, the seam isn't too noticeable. It's there, but it's not too bad. And thankfully, well, they took the effort to line it up when they put it in. But yeah, look his deal for it. Sort of cheatily show it off like this, so inner working, so you should be able to. I'm just gonna pull the deck box from last time out. Will it fit? Not in the slightest. Well, can't say I didn't try. It would be cool to show up to a tournament going, here's my devil fruit. We have three packs, one don card and the card sleeves. Gonna take that out now because that's just gonna bow the Don cards like no tomorrow. So, uh, and the bottom half. Put that to the side. I'll leave the top half sitting off over here. Alrighty, up first is the Don card. I will try and open this. I'm gonna use. But the scissors, I don't know where they've gone. I will use scissors like usual. It's a lot less risky. I say that after I almost thought I cut the card last time. So, so up first we have the uh, well, the manga panel of Luffy stabbing himself under the eye. Very nice Don card as usual. We also have the, uh, the Gum Gum Nomi or Gum Gum Fruit uh, card sleeve card. So, might as well put them to use. So, very nice with those ones. Uh, and then we have three booster packs, so we got uh, we got somewhat lucky last video, see how we get this one, I say somewhat lucky, we got, we got one card, I'll do the usual though, I'll quickly uh, focus, quickly jump through them all, the only uh, potentially new ones are the back two, so ooh, we have, so they do have the alternate arts, uh, holographic treble. Uh, put a hand off to the side. And we have, so I was somewhat not expected to do this, but I guess they are just 
random pack. So we have alternate art of a uh, alternate art or secret rare. We have the secret rare of Nefertari Vivi. Very impressive the uh, the rainbow effect on her hair. Now, just as a side note, the fun part. So for the one-offs, I did buy that one already. So, uh, yay me, I guess. Nope. Always a risk when uh, trying to collect all the cards and you're still still buying new ones and having the old ones around. Oh, sorry. Buying buying one-offs and then still buying the booster packs. There is always the chance that happens. So, not much you can do about it sometimes. Alrighty, we have Holographic Frankie and Holographic Monkey D. Luffy. Am I able to get all moves up there, that there, and that there? Alrighty, and the lucky last for the set will go with the uh, Pillars of Strength booster box. Booster box? Jeez, I've been too many booster boxes. Booster pack. And once more. The usual... Uh, a leader ace, it was a leader ace. Jeez, where is that? Oh, right, they come with Don cards. Wait, oh, they do come with Don cards. Why don't the other ones come with Don cards? Anyway, Don card. Ah, and we have holographic Belmy and holographic death poison gas bomb. So, that's very nice. Now, one thing I have just noticed, because I have opened the other one up on the side, I commented on how good they were at lining it up, but then I realised it's essentially keyed. So, it will only go together one way. So, very nice, but I take back, somewhat take back my compliment of how amazing they did it. So, second one. Uh, we have both the other Don card and the alternate, uh, well, Pell and, oh, I forget his name. Chaka. Pell and Chaka uh, card sleeves. We'll open up the. Of the Don card. So for this one we have uh, the mangle panel of Luffy versing Crocodile there. Which with what I think is, well, one of Luffy's pretty much signature catchphrases at this point. So, and this one I guess I'll put in uh, this card there, so we're using some of them. Alrighty, we'll go the same order. Kingdoms of Intrigue, followed by uh, Pillars of Strength. Uh, I mean, at this point, nothing new there. Alrighty, we have Holographic Cavendish and Holographic Mr. Five Gem. Gem or Gem? Either or. Still, uh, I still say they keep getting better and better as they are. Uh, each of the generations go on. I did find out that uh, oh, we have Roronora Zora and Gum Gum Red Rock. I did find out that only, what, Generation 4, I think it was, they started doing, uh, the stars on the, uh, cards for the alternate art, which is nice. 
All of that being said, I imagine they started doing the same thing with the Japanese versions at the same time, so I don't know why they didn't update the English ones when they came out, seeing as there's about a 6 to 12 month delay on them. But who am I? Who am I to judge? I, don't know, I didn't really think the Don cards were each of them, but maybe they were, and I'm just not paying attention, and the new ones don't have the Don cards, because... It's Generation 7 now. Or well, what are they up to? Four. Four? Four. Oh, and we have Holographic Marshall D Teach and Holographic Brand New. So, very nice there. Well, no, I was about to end it there, but then I realised I've got a few of the one offs. So, move that a bit over. Move the uh, holographics out of the way keep the uh, new holographics here. So we have, uh, I'll try to sort them a bit. They're a bit all over the place, but we have uh, Sanji, holographic. These are all holographic, so I'll just go through. We have Sanji with a sort of a, I don't know, sort of a fabric-y pattern, but using Skywalk, obviously the, the bird in the background. I believe that might also be one of the, uh, unless they all were, um, one of the anime title cards. Then we have Don Quixote Don Flamenco. Very impressive there. Then we have uh, Magellan. I shall try to get the other one in the back there. There we go. We have Magellan. Uh, one of the sort of special art style editions for uh, Kingdoms of Intrigue. Looks like it's got cells in the background, but obviously the poison, poison devil fruit user. Uh, then Edward Newgate with, oh, I guess, earthquake shattering in the background. Sort of a very, uh, very realistic looking art style. Or painted looking art style, I should say. Then we have the Nefeltari Vivi, which already matches the existing Nefeltari Vivi. So, put those two together. We have a Yamato. Nice, uh, Nice moon, moon effect for the moon in the background, and then I think the blue section of her hair, the blue and purple of her hair is uh, holographic, but not the rest of it, which is nice. So, very cool. Uh, Mr. Five Gim. So, I should also specify these are all the alternate arts, uh, or in this case, Boodle's. Uh, Holographic, I think it was a bonus for one of the five booster boxes you get one of these bonus cards. Actually, there's probably a few of them. So, Boodle's one of them. Uh, Cardiff is another one. And that's the last one for the One Piece gift collection 2023. So, we have Frankie. Drinking, uh, drinking cola. We have a missile Sunday. Speaking of, I do wonder which, uh, if they do do a version two of the uh, Devil Fruits, I wonder which one they'll choose next. Because if you're going with the Straw Hats, obviously, it'll be Chopper or Robin next. Uh, but if you're going in terms of Devil Fruits in general, I guess the uh, uh, the Mera Merida no Mi would be probably the next one that would be the Merida Merida no Mi would be the next one. So the, the Flame Flame Fruit or Aces and Sabo's Fruit. Uh, then we have Holographic Buggy, again part of the sort of Boogle Boodle 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 Califa collection. Uh, Speed Jill, also part of the same collection. 
and Shirahoshi. Uh, again, part of the same collection. So that's everything for today, everyone. Uh, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care.